Hello, 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 everybody. Welcome to the channel. My name is Lindsay, and this is Life with Lindsay. Today, we have an unboxing. Um, this one comes to us from DIY Moon Shop. If you guys saw the first video of the three unboxings that I have to share with you guys, I will link that one up in the eye. Um, I'm very, very excited. Uh, I'm going to probably move a little bit quicker through this one because the last one that I posted had a lot more detail about the changes between my first order and this order um, and all of that fun stuff. So if you guys haven't had a chance to watch that, make sure you check that one out and come back to this. So at first I thought the boxes were um, not supposed to, to be like this, but now I realize that's exactly how they were built. Uh, this is a stark contrast from the original uh, which just came in cardboard. If you guys did not know that, um, they've changed the canvas. They've changed um, the shipping. But let me get this one out and chit-chat with you guys. I hope that you guys are all well. Um, I'm definitely going to touch base on some of the things I went over in the last one. But uh, that one was much more in-depth. And I had a lot of thoughts and opinions on that. I didn't share the toolkit in the previous video but it's a pretty basic kit it has your pad of wax a uh, boat a squishy pen uh this is a large placer and a pair of tweezers um doo -doo -doo. this one and the new canvases are soft back cover okay i'm upside down uh soft back cover soft back canvas and oh look at the little hippo uh Sorry, I'm like distracting myself. Let me zoom out so you guys can see. It is a soft canvas with the seared and scalloped edges. Uh, it is much more soft and flexible than the original canvases that they used to have. I have so much stuff on my desk. I apologize. Um, days like today, I film and then I edit and process and then I film some more. But this Look how cute it is. This is Hippos. This is version B. This is the more cropped version. Um, there is the other version, which is a wider angle. Um, I might do this for, I think, Nautical November is the name of the event. But anyway, this canvas I purchased, it is a 63 by 50. It is a round drill canvas. Um... It has 44 colors, including one AB, it appears. So the way that they do ABs now uh, is it is included in your canvas, um, but it's not charted. So what they do is they give you an AB and then they give you the non-AB version or a, a similar color and you can put as much or as little of it as you want. The nice thing about that is for this one here, it's uh, 3865 that they have charted and then they've given me the 5200 AB as an option to place if I would like to. Um, but you can put as much as little. You don't have to do either. Um, some people will mix their regular drill and their AB together in a tray and just kind of work. Um, I like that they give you the same amount. So if you want to replace it like a one for one ratio, you can do that. Um, however, I personally would prefer to not have to think. You know what I mean? Like, I just want it to be laid out, and then I can just do it as charted. But I love these cute little hippos. Obviously, there's going to be hippos. It's called hippos. Um, I have done a couple pieces of Sybil art, her artwork. Uh, I've never done a Sybil art canvas from DIY Moon Shop or Die Moon Shop. Um, if you would like to see the latest civil art canvas that I've completed, I will link the post review for you guys up in the eye. That is a crafties kit. Um, I just love this image. Uh, let me pull out, sorry for the crinkling. I feel like there's a theme with the paintings that I purchased from them. They're all like really soft pink palettes, which is not necessarily me. Um, so let me show you guys here. This is the original. Hey, you want to focus? Um, it does come with an inventory sheet. I imagine we took two sheets. Yep. Okay. So I don't know why they do this. If anybody knows, let me know. 
So they print 37 colors on one sheet and then the rest of the colors on a second sheet. Um, but as I mentioned, they give you the exact same amount of drills for the AB version of the one that they want to. It's interesting that they chose 5200 and 3865. They're both whites. But it's interesting that they didn't do 5200 AB for 5200. Um, but let's see. So this is a definitely a softer rendering style than like your Diamond Art Club or your Dreamer Designs. Uh, I feel like there are two kinds of people, I guess three, two kinds of people mainly in this uh, world that you have the people who like those crisp, clean lines. Um, I would be in that. And then you have the people who prefer this softer watercolor style of rendering. And then you have the people who just don't care how it's rendered. They just love the beautiful images. So um, I'm definitely somebody who does love the crisp lines. But I love, you can see so much detail in the background. The little stars, which I assume are more like, I was going to say starfish, but maybe not. And then she's got her little mermaid tail holding her little baby hippo here. Um, <coughs> And then there is another little hippo. Look at that little snoot. Oh my gosh, you guys. How cute is this? Um, they used to render it more where the colors would bleed from one square to the next. So that it would give it a more well-rounded finish in the end. Um, but now it is much more... I'm stuck. Each square has its own color. I don't know why that looks so blurry. Um... It's probably just my camera. So I'm enjoying the image of this. I honestly feel like this could have even been cropped even more and just done the one hippo. I'm not, I don't hate on you, hippo number two, but um, everything does come pre-bagged. Are these in order? Yes. There is 310, so let's grab out some 310. Mm-hmm. <laughs> So, you can see here, um, this is something that I've mentioned before. I've mentioned it in my previous video, um, which I don't think I've already mentioned it. I will link Alice and Alice and Roses, Alice, whatever the Alice one is called. I'll link the post review for that one up here. Um, the drills, the quality of them seem fine, but they're like not very sparkly. They're pretty dull. Uh, which, I mean, isn't that kind of the point? We want, like, beautiful sparkle drills. I'm going to get on my, my soapbox here for one moment, and then I'm going to hop back off. Um, previously, they used to... DIY Moonshop has a higher price point for their canvases and for their shipping. The reason that the prices used to be the way they were is because they used to have a... Uh, sorry, I'm trying to put these back in order here. Um, I'm going to pull out the AB as well. I talked to you guys. It's a big old bag of white ABs. If you don't know what an AB is, it is an Aurora Borealis. It is a regular drill that has this extra shiny like holographic coating on it. It reflects all of the drills around it. It makes them look brighter. It makes this, that, them, they make this look brighter. Ooh, words are hard. Um, but this is often used, especially 5200, is often used for accents and highlights and little things like that. And I will look to see where they um, have the original so you can decide whether you want to use them or not. But anyway, they used to have a higher price point because all of the canvases would come from their manufacturer to them in the Philippines. They are based out of the Philippines. And from there... They would hand wrap each one of your packages. Um, you used to be able to have your name printed on your canvas, which is no longer a thing. Um, they would wrap your canvases. They would put it in wrapping paper. They would include stickers and, and all these extra goodies. And all these people kept saying to me, but Lindsay, it's the experience. You're paying for the experience. And I said, listen to me. I don't care about wrapping paper. I don't care about stickers. Like stickers are great, but so many small shops send me stickers when I make purchases that I have just an overabundance of stickers that I could never use if I even wanted to. And then the other part of the high price point was that they sent it, I believe it was UPS, from, from them, from their home, 
to wherever you lived. Fast forward to now where they've changed their canvases and they now ship directly from the manufacturer. So you're not getting that special treatment, the hand wrapped packages, the extras, um, but the prices are still the same. And then also it's shipping directly from the manufacturer. So there's no expedited shipping. Uh, I'm sure you can pay for expedited shipping, but there's no um, shipping like the way it was, but the shipping costs are still high. So I made this purchase. I purchased all three of these. It was actually a 50% off sale. I believe I misspoke in my last video and all three of my canvases were 50% off, um, which is why I wound up doing it. So the letter A, which I can see a little bit in the eyes are going to have, okay. So all the stars here, me personally, I would probably do the entire star in the ABs just because I like the way that looks. Um, but I do like the color palette on this. It's really, really pretty. Um, it is sticky, but it's not the stickiest that I've felt. This is a very thin plastic cover. This is a very thin soft back uh, canvas as well. Like, I could just, like... Crumple it. I'm not going to crumple it completely. I know that somebody's watching this probably going, <gasps> don't do that, but it's poured glue. Um, I do like that they legally license all of their artwork. Let's see if it is true to size. It's 50. That's on the nose. Um, you know, I can do a lot of things, two things at the same time, but talking and measuring. Oh shit. Shoot. Sorry. I just, sure yep, just definitely, and 62, so it's a centimeter short, which is fine. Um, sorry, a canvas that I had on my desk just fell that way, and uh, my husband's sitting over there, so I didn't want to attack him. Um, I will say, I absolutely adore this image, and I have intentions on working on all of these canvases. Like, I didn't buy them to just be like, all right, well, let's look at what the differences are, hee-haw. Um, I really do plan on working on all of these. Um, the first canvas that I unboxed, like, I want to work on that one, like, ASAP, I have so many things I want to work on ASAP, so check in in a few months and see where I'm at. Um, but I, I do, I love the image. I just, I want to have my socks knocked off with a, a canvas from them. Um, and I have yet to have that happen. Um, but again, I've only worked on one, so hopefully adding three more to my collection will change all that. But I'm going to get out of here before I ramble too, too much. Um... Thank you guys for hanging out. If you enjoyed this video and you'd like to see more videos like this or nothing like this at all, please make sure to give this video two thumbs up, one real life, one virtual. Make sure you guys hit that subscribe button. Come join the Sparkle Squad. While you're there, hit that notification bell. Yay. I do not operate on any sort of schedule. I operate on toddler standard time and I record while my tiny human is sleeping or sleeping. Thank you guys so much for being here. I'll see you in my next one. Bye, guys. <laughs>